And now to some more cheering news. The creme de la creme of Nigeria Nollywood and media executives all gathered to celebrate a thespian and film executive Uludotun Bayou Jacobs as he clocks 80 years. The event which was held in Lagos brought together actors, media executives and other entertainers who paid glowing tribute to the icon. Our correspondent Paul George was there. Gathered in this hall to celebrate the veteran actor Olu Jacobs are the current governor of Ekiti State, Kayo De Fahemi, and his wife, B.C. Fahemi. Former deputy governor of Lagos State, Adijoke Orelokwe Adefuliri. Former executive director of the Nigerian Television Authority, NTA, Peter Ego, and many Nigerians from all walks of life. The event kicked off with the national anthem and was followed by a dance drama and documentary that was beamed in honor of the octogenarian. Jacob's contemporary, a veteran actor, Taiwo Ajayi Lysette, who spoke alongside another veteran broadcaster, Sonny Irabo, recounts their memorable moment with the icon. Uh, a pioneer in Hollywood, a person who is committed to what he does and is giving so much to the development of entertainment in this country, at least the performing arts. Uh, he and I go way back. We started together in England at Actor Studio. We worked together at various things abroad, international festivals and all that. We've worked here in Nigeria as well. So he's a good friend of mine and I wish him well. He's in the book of times. It will never be forgotten for what he, for the contribution is made to the development of our industry. Thank you very much. Happy birthday, Olu. Olu Dotu. Well done. Olu Jacobs was one human being that we are all very proud to have started with and I'm very, very proud to be with him here today. You know. So we were together in Second Chance, 1984. So you can imagine how long ago that was. And of course, Joker was in our class. He was the headmaster. I was a small teacher. So you see, history has come around. Happy birthday, Uncle Lulu. God bless you. Also, the likes of Bimbo Luyedi, Ali Baba, and other entertainers poured encomiums on the maestro as they wished him a happy birthday. He's a man who is very passionate about his, uh, about his craft, about his art. And he's very thorough about the way he, he's thorough in the way he goes about doing his work. He creates, you know, an entire persona so that he's able to embody each character that he portrays. Um, so professionally, you know, he's, he's, he's difficult to match and certainly difficult, if not impossible, to beat. Exceptional, exemplary, professional, uh, also creative agent, uh, uh, father figure, great tutor, inspirational leader in the sector, respected. Done so much that we cannot forget and uh, I celebrate him all the time. I call him Emperor. He's iconic, he's an iconic figure, I mean, I've said it three times this evening, he's as iconic as it gets in these parts, a living legend. More than an icon, a veteran, a highly gifted and talented man, a man who loves his craft and enjoys working with other people. The high point of the event was the cutting of the cake by the celebrant, and while guests were being entertained, the celebrant's ever supportive wife, Joker Silva, couldn't hide her joy as she danced to express her appreciation to God and the guest who had made the event a success. Paul George, Plus TV News. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.